So I joined the army as an officer about a month before my 24th birthday. My dad was in the army, so traveled around UK, Northern Ireland, Germany, the armed forces sort of lifestyle and stand by your bed and all that. It was well ingrained. I'm originally from Trinidad and Tobago, did three tours of Iraq, attained the rank of corporal. I served for 24 years and I found that I had tremendous meaning and purpose within the military environment. And I really found my mission. There is a culture in the military of being tough. It was 13 years of, you know, being blown up, being shot at, saving lives. You had friends that supported you and you supported them. You didn't do stuff for yourself. You did it for the bloke next to you. My first five years was very, very tough. I was a female. I'm black, sounding funny. We are typically conditioned not to show signs of vulnerability and not to show signs of emotional weakness, if you want to call it that. If I could go back in time now and, and speak to myself and my soldiers, I would say that being tough is not about being brittle. It's about having some depth to your toughness. And I think also in the military, we had a really strong set of values and those values that were shared by our friends, by colleagues, those people that have served alongside us. I just think perceptions of how we must be because of the environment we've been in is that we have to be angry, violent people when actually we're very proud and the wheels have just come off. I never felt that saying loudly and proudly, I am a veteran, it would matter to anyone. I have decided over the years to just just keep it to myself.